We can add static LED fixtures to our rig in much the same way that we added static conventional fixtures. Let's go ahead and select 51 through 53. And we're gonna move back up to our patch section. We're gonna assign those a type of color source spot. And we're gonna have those in direct mode. So we'll choose those. And we'll say at two slash one to patch those. And we'll move back down to the augmented section here. We're gonna go ahead and give those all a Y and Z dimension off the bat here. So we'll type our position box, a slash, because we're not doing X yet. They're gonna be two feet upstage on our Y axis and 35 feet in the air at their Z height. I'm gonna go ahead and reorient my model so we can go ahead and see those. And now we're gonna go ahead and give those an X dimension. So we'll hit next and we'll say position 24, enter. And that's gonna assume X because that's the first number there. It'll fill in the Y and Z as asterisks for us there, just like before. We'll hit next, position 16 and next position four. So we've got some pipe end fixtures spaced eight feet apart. And now go ahead and reselect the whole group. And we want to point those toward the stage. So we're going to give their Y axis 45 degrees of rotation. This is a good way to rough in the rotation of our fixtures. We will cover a way to aim static fixtures later on.